Have you ever seen those videos on your TikTok for you page like this? It's finally here, everyone. <laughs> well, today I'm going to show you how to install these custom Wii channels. First off, you're going to need a, a, a homebrewed Wii. If you don't know how to do that, click the link in the description to go to a Wii. To go to the Wii mod Wii.god and be told how to do it. Now, with that being said, you will also need a SD card and a SD card reader on your computer or an adapter. Either what and an internet connection, obviously, but whatever. Okay, let's get into the video. Okay, you're gonna wanna go to the other link in the description to the Wii GitHub thing to download Wii Mod Lite. Okay, now you're gonna wanna download it. Once it is downloaded, as you can see, you're going to want to unzip the zip archive using WinRAR or the built-in Windows one or whichever one you like. Okay, so you're going to want to go inside that folder and then click on Wii Mod Lite. Well, don't click in it. Click on the folder and click copy and copy it. Now go to your SD card. If you don't already have it, make an apps folder. Okay, so once you're in the apps folder, you're going to want to paste it in there. I already have it but I pasted it again to reinstall it. But, so once you have that pasted in, we're gonna go over to the Wii. Wait, actually, no, I forgot a step. Okay, so once you have that pasted in, you're gonna download the WAD. Okay, so we're in Discord and Yoshibot server because that's where I wanna get my thing at, my WAD. So I'm gonna click on the WADs by Yoshibot channel and find the one that I want. I'm gonna do Hong Kong 97 because I'm just a menace to society. So, I'm going to click on that link. Okay, well, freak. But this one's on whatever, I guess, the file is too powerful or something. But you're going to want to click on that. So, once I'll be right in Chrome here in a second. Okay, I'm going to download it from the Media Fire link, as you can see. So, once I have it downloaded, I'm going to show you what to do after it downloads. Okay, so, get your Wii, copy it. Get your wallet I meant, copy it to your clipboard again. Now make a folder on the root of your SD card called WAD. Okay, and go into that folder and paste it inside of it. Okay, we're on the Wii again. You're going to want to put your SD card back in. Just give me just a second because this is a voice recording, right? So just give it just a second for it to pop up in the corner for me. Okay, it's fixing to get recognized. Now click your homebrew channel. Okay, now go in start the homebrew channel so let's wait on it to load okay so now go into the Wii Mod Lite on your thing and wait on it to load here it may take a bit and if your screen kind of glitches out a little bit it's okay well mine didn't do it but sometimes my other Wii does it okay go over to Wad Manager you do that using the arrow keys by the way select your SD card slot now click your wad I used Hong Kong 97 so click on it with A now install wad now wait on it to install okay it just finished now push any key to continue now you're gonna want to push the home button to go back to the homebrew launcher now or channel crap gotta mix up the DS now click the home button again and click exit the system menu now wait on it to go back to your home menu now, as you can see, right there is my absolute masterpiece of a wad. Now, of course, I didn't know you needed a Wii Classic controller, so I couldn't actually put any gameplay. I wouldn't be able to with the video would get demonetized, because apparently the game on screen really your graphic or something, so you, you need a Wii Classic controller. So that kind of sucks. Either way, guys, peace out.